When Ed Miller rides into town, it often means wrangling on the river. Ed, a non-game biologist for Kansas Wildlife and Parks at Elk City Wildlife Area, has a particular fascination with the small fish and mussels in southeastern Kansas streams. These seldom seen creatures are good indicators of a river's water quality. I recently caught up with Ed at Shoal Creek and Spring River where he sained for spring darters in their beautiful breeding colors. Aided by Max Good, a Parsons Audubon Chapter volunteer, the pair chanced upon a couple of college wildlife biology majors on a spring break fishing trip. Weston Fleming, Fort Hayes State, and Jesse Pounds, Kansas State University, were curious about what these clear rivers held, so they generously sacrificed a day of their fishing to help with the sampling and gain experience in their chosen field. The foursome donned waders and sampled the cold waters with a large net. They used a technique known as kick seining, where a disturbance upstream flushes fish into a waiting seine. The small fish were checked for species and condition, and then released back into their homes. Banded darters were in splendid color. These green striped fish are rare in Kansas and are listed as a species in need of conservation. Speckled darters, another Shoal Creek species, also carry this special designation. A more common small fish that is unsurpassed for color is the orange-throated darter. With bright blue and orange markings, this brightly hued species is the peacock of the stream. Other finds included mad toms, cardinal shiners, rosy-faced shiners, slim minnows, and stone rollers. Several mussel species were also noted. As usual, the day's seining showed that these Kansas Ozarkian streams earned an A for water quality. It was a day of discovery and good news in the Kansas outdoors. I'm Mike Blair for Kansas Wildlife and Parks.